Well, hello there, YouTube. Welcome to another gorgeous day. Today is the 25th of July. Poor old Dan will go through this little morning ritual of him crying. He does not like being pinned up. But we just can't, can't risk leaving him out. Not just yet. He does really good while we're here. And he'd probably do fine otherwise, but I don't know. We love that little boy. As you can see, we still have Sawyer and Hennessy. So much for the couple of day thing. But you guys probably knew that was gonna happen just like I did, didn't you? <laughs> we made it to hump day. <laughs> Look at Sierra on that spider. <laughs> yeah, she works in service, she's awesome. Man, what a go-getter she is. But mama? Where's that crazy? Oh, there it is up there. There was this crazy squall line thing just floating out of there out of nowhere with polarized glasses on. Man, it looks so cool. But anyway, I'm going to roll on down. I love you. See you. Bye. All right. We'll see you. Bye. I don't know if the camera will stay in focus, but look at this thing. How creepy is that? There's just blue skies everywhere else. Creepy. So I've been working away on this. 2016 S1000 R single R. I've actually taken you guys, I think, a couple times on test rides on this. He put some miles on this thing. I think he's got a whole slew of BMWs actually. I think he's got some, I think he's got a R1200 R, maybe a couple of, I don't know, he's got a whole slew of motorcycles. But uh, he likes right, he takes trips on this thing. I'm telling you, these, these what they refer to as a naked sport bike they're very comfortable it's a very neutral kind of old super sport I guess you could say not super bike but super sport kind of riding position very fun so uh, what do you think should we take it for a rip I don't want to make this a whole nother S1000 something vlog but let's go take it for a rip I gotta ride it anyway will not you guys come on along hold tight that gum thing done took off and ran outside. Whoa, she's even out there running. We better, <laughs> we better go catch up to her before she just takes off and goes on a test ride without us. Hold on, gal. Takes me a second to get my helmet on, you know. All sitting out here running, ready to go. You are a wild one. Yep, I did bump his mirror. Back in, back in the thing off the rack there and I went Doop. <clears throat> said to myself self I probably just knocked that mirror out <sighs> caught him before he got to me huh I seen him though yeah see this has got almost that XR kind of a riding position the XR is a little taller bars and set back a little bit it feels like a it feels like an adventure bike it's kind of like this hybrid you know sport bike adventure bike kind of funky thing going on there oh here's some cool vi oh she's got some strong brakes i just put some new pads on it holy moly and i need to be careful too because i put a new front tire on there as well Trying to drag no pegs or nothing. <laughs> it's not all to do that anyway. I don't even do that on my own motorcycle. Although I do on my street glide. I do some things off camera that I can't even talk about on that thing. She goes like real fast. Man, I'm here to tell you, them brakes are stout. Them pads aren't even worn in yet. about halfway about 50 percent on them but he puts a lot of miles on this thing but he comes in you know the old computer starts telling him you know when it's time and he comes in right on cue it won't take him long to rack the miles up he loves his motorcycles this 
sat that way on purpose, but that's, that's technically not within specs. He's got adjustable levers on there. But I wasn't going to mess with it, but I'm going to hand it over to him in specs and let him make whatever adjustments. for the street? No, no, maybe. It's amazing some of the stock exhaust that uh, BMW gets away with. I've ridden some sport bikes with a uh, aftermarket slip-ons that don't have the nice bark this thing does. Uh, all that power. It doesn't have the high horsepower number that the RRs have, but it has power where you actually use it in like everyday riding, you know. The RRs meant more for wide open down the racetrack. You just have this good mid-range grunt. Five minutes to five now. Everybody's the guys can get out earlier. Getting out. Wow. I mean, that thing's got some crazy front brakes. It's just amazing how little you have to get on this thing to make it part. I think I hit that mirror a little harder than I thought. I thought I felt it creak. You know. take the wind, but they don't take a uh, hit somebody's shoulder in the back and all. <laughs> like ours, a black version, not the black edition, just a, a black colored one. S1000s in the last couple of days. Probably not the best thing for a, a weak-minded person like myself. <laughs> they start thinking about these things in your sleep. We are something else. Man. We are a go-getter. I haven't had any, any issues with them. I haven't had any issues with them. Absolutely nothing I can think of. People talk. People tossing them down the road. With bikes like this, you know, that kind of stuff's going to happen. It's just too tempting to play with all that power, you know. I don't think he's picking up for the moss. So I'm going to go ahead and put it inside. Let it stay down here where it's nice and cool. Thanks 
once again for coming along for a test ride. I didn't get much filming done today. It's kind of running around like a chicken missing its noggin, you know? Yeah, buddy. Things are sweet. <laughs> They're such a good looking bite, too. Holy moly. We'll be leaving here in a few. You know, it's 95 degrees out here. And you don't even think about the heat. You get a couple days of it, and it's just, it's just another day. Nobody complains. Nobody's crying about the heat anymore. You know, when you first get those mid 90s, 100 degree days, everybody's like, "Oh my God, it's so hot." And then it just becomes that's just the thing, you know. <laughs> All right, I'll talk to you later. Part of the reason I, uh, I, I think I cut that clip out yesterday but part of the reason I called it all about S1000s yesterday is well, look at this plethora of these things here this is a used one we took in it's a 2010 first year for them this is the demo bike that didn't quite make it to a demo that's the carbon fiber bike which by the way those wheels were not offered by BMW it was aftermarket ordered from some company and it has ceramic bearings and this is my theory if that chain was that tight with 800 miles and the guy picked the bike up with 200 miles on it I'm thinking the chain was way tighter and I think an over tight chain took out the ceramic bearings in that fancy carbon fiber wheel just my thinking and then the beautiful S1000 I just took for a ride so yeah I kind of got S1000s all around me here I'm telling you that kind of stuff will make a guy uh, start thinking some crazy thoughts. <laughs> but uh, this is my my uh, acquisition for for tomorrow. I I don't know what all it's. I think it's a big service tire. I don't know what all we're doing to it. But look how clean this thing is. I know the gentleman that owns this thing and he just babies it. That thing is like brand new. Everybody wants that red to come back, and for some reason, BRP, maybe 2019 will change, but people want that red. Come on, BRP, bring her back out. All right, about time to go. Well, little woman? Yes, Still 95 degrees. It's been 95 for quite a while, actually. It's funny how you get used to it. I was. maybe in his car after it sat in the parking lot and I don't think it made it to 99 today it's hot but it ain't that hot alrighty that's how you get 99 degrees the truck thinks it's 101 it ain't even close I already hit the stop recording button oh. Kelly's with her mumbling what if I wasn't ready yeah you just jump in the car ready. he says go now come on now woman <laughs> Look at that. Quarter after seven, it's still 85 degrees. Man, the sunset's already dropped to 8.48. No wonder it was already starting to get dark at 8.30 last night. You know, other than a snowstorm, I don't think I've ever seen this truck stop so packed. All the way to the very far back, it is just packed. Oop, I'm filled up. Hey, I got a little bit more than $3 in it today. <laughs> Kelly ran into a red apple to grab something right quick. Look what's sitting in the parking lot. Little wide glide. Last of the diners. Yeah, I think that was actually a low rider. Kind of looks like a little That's why I don't ever zoom this camera. She's a creaker, man. Look at that. That's where all the all the pretty plants and flowers were. All that spring excitement about all the new plat stuff. It's all got to come to an end. That's all right. I think that, that low rider had stock exhaust on it. Stone stocked. Looks like it's probably about a 07 or so. Cool though. Still cool. Well, hello there, YouTube. How are you guys doing today? Hope you had a wonderful day. It was nice and warm and very dry and a fun day for me anyway. Kelly, whew, 
man, is it busy up there. It is crazy. Service riders and parts people, man, they are just, there's not enough people. That's crazy. Yeah. Phones are literally going off the wall, and you don't have enough people. And the unfortunate thing of that is phone calls aren't getting answered. You just physically can't do it. Yeah. It's absolutely nuts. I mean, as hard as they try, you only, you know, can only do so much. But anyway, very busy, very fun day. And worked on worked on beamers again today. Tomorrow's gonna be a spider day. Gonna start off with a with an older RT. I ain't sure what all I'm doing to it. Um, I don't know. I'll see when I get the RO tomorrow. There's gonna be some travelers swinging through, and I'm gonna put a headlight in an RT Limited. Don't know what year or whatever, but they're traveling through. So we'll, we'll do a little emergency roadside. Well, roadside for them is gonna be the shop for me. Yes. <laughs> but um, anyway. Hopefully tomorrow will be just as fun. Hopefully get to ride something tomorrow. If I don't get to ride something to work, guess what happens when I come home? You have to take a <laughs> ride. Kelly goes, well, I need to go on one of those rides. I said, well, you're more than welcome to come to one of those rides. So you got to go see some of that evening light that you're missing as you're sitting at home with the dogs. I know it. So maybe we'll do a dual vlog after work ride or something. Yeah, that'd be fun. Might as well, while the yeah. days are lasting. Why we can. Yeah, why we can. Because yeah. it, it'll all just, all of a sudden, just come to Go a screeching boom. halt. Yeah. Yeah. You'd be going, oh, no, what happened? <laughs> yep. Blink of an eye. Heck, yeah. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and roll on out on y'all. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her a thumbs up. And you guys have a wonderful Thursday or Friday. Heck, yeah. Thank you guys. Man, it's muggy out here. It is very muggy. Yeah, it's like thick as thieves out here. Mm -hmm. All right. Talk to you guys tomorrow. You guys take <laughs> Thank care. Thank you guys very much. Bye bye now.